Tonight's greatest hit is our final one. Sad, I know. But in the spirit of celebrating everything I love about the show, today I'm highlighting my favorite greatest hits of all time. I know, how can I do that? Well, first up, there was the bird scooter chained to a refrigerator door next to a dumpster in a DC alley. Somehow the scooter is the least ridiculous thing in this picture. I have questions about that alley fridge. The first being who left the door open. That is a very easy way to get yelled at at any black household, really in, in, in any household, but I'm black so I'm speaking from my experience or trauma if you want to get clinical about it. Somehow this is even funnier than the scooter that was stuck up in the tree. Yes, that one looks spiteful, but the dumpster fridge scooter has a level of ratchet dignity to it. Somebody is coming back for that thing. One could say this is trash behavior in the most literal and hilarious sense, but I do thank this person for all the laughter their ashy creativity gave me. Now, just imagine if it was stolen. The writer will be in that alley out here quoting Omarion like, I got this icebox where my ride used to be. And speaking of trash behavior, that leads me to the second greatest hit I want to honor. The aftermath of a crab leg feast on a Silver Line Metro train. This is the most selfish thing I have ever seen on the Metro and also the most DC thing. Not the people who play music out loud with no headphones, not the man spreaders, but this right here. First of all, you're not even supposed to eat anything on the Metro, but they should double the fine for whoever had a crab feast. You belong on a shellfish watch list. And by the way, if any of you ever witnessed a crab feast on the Metro, please tell on them. If you see something, say something was meant for this. It's not snitching if it stinks. See something, say something. Speaking of seeing something, the next greatest hit I want to honor, the man riding a Doc Capital rideshare bike at the Rockville Metro Station. Oh, this just makes my cheapskate heart sing. Nothing will stop this guy's workout. Not gym fees not, or a bike share membership. Wherever this man is, I salute you, sir, like Hank the Tank. I don't know why I said that. He's probably in the exact same place since the bike is docked, but still, I salute him. Which brings me to the last greatest hit I want to revisit. The pair of abandoned shoes left on the side of a trash can in Noma. Lord have mercy, this is the saddest thing I have ever seen. Somebody abandoned shoes that look like the love child of a pair of Ugg boots and car upholstery. These lonely, fuzzy, open-toed abominations were left in the hope that a new owner would choose them, yet they remain unchosen. If you or a loved one cares about comfort, but not your reputation, please consider rescuing these free range struggle shoes. They're probably still hanging from the side of that very same trash can. I do want to thank everyone that has shared a greatest hit with me. There was so many good contributions. Naturally, we couldn't get to all of them, but thank you nonetheless. And feel free to keep sending me funny sites to reese.waters at gmail.com, especially fight videos. Extra credit if they come from a Waffle House. We'll be right back.